hyphens WhatsApp DCRK phone 360 data. It's time to talk about the best tips to fix. iPhone gets stuck on search screen. With iOS 16, Apple has placed the search button right on the iPhone home screen so that you can get started with searching with just a tap. Though the search button works reliably at times, it does start throwing tantrum and causes the iPhone to get stuck on the search screen. But there is no need to worry about it as I have found some workarounds to fix the problem. That said, let's get started. First off, I would recommend you to hard reset your iPhone. When it comes to fixing an annoying issue like this one, hard reset has long been highly effective. So I'm going to give it a chance to fix the ill-functioning search button. To do so, press and quickly release the volume up button. Then press and quickly release the volume down button. Then you have to hold down the power button or the side button until you see the Apple logo on the screen. Once your iPhone has rebooted, check out if the problem is gone. If it has, you have gotten the better at the problem. After that, I would suggest you to update your iPhone. What if your iPhone often gets stuck at the search screen and you have to use the force reset to get rid of the problem? Well, in that case, it could be due to a software bug. Hence, updating the software may help you resolve the problem permanently. To update your iPhone, open the settings app. Then tap on general. After that, tap on software update and finally download and install the latest version of iOS. Then I will suggest you to disable the search button. If the problem persists on your iPhone and your device often tends to get frozen while you hit the search button, I will suggest you to turn off the search button itself. To do so, open the settings app on your iPhone. Now tap on home screen and finally turn off the toggle next to show on home screen. Next up, I will suggest you to change the default keyboard app. If you are using a third party keyboard app, make sure the keyboard app is updated and running well. Should the third party keyboard app continues to misbehave, even after you have updated it, change the default keyboard app and choose Apple's Quick Tap keyboard app. To do so, open the settings app on your iPhone, then tap on General. After that, tap on Keyboard, then tap on Keyboards. Then tap on the edit button at the top right corner of the screen. Next, touch and hold on the three horizontal lines next to your keyboard and drag it at the top. In the end, make sure to tap on done at the top right corner of the screen to confirm the action. And finally, I would suggest you to factory reset your iPhone. Note that it will get rid of all the custom settings such as your home screen layout. However, none of your media and data will be harmed. To factory reset your iPhone, open the Settings app, then tap on General. After that, tap on Transfer a Reset iPhone. Then tap on Reset, and finally tap on Reset All Settings and confirm the action. That's all there is to it. Hopefully you have gotten the better at the problem and your iPhone has returned to normal and the stuck search screen is gone for good. Make sure to share your feedback along with a tip that has helped you overcome this frustrating problem. And I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye.